Welcome to Power Coat Music. In this presentation, we're going to do an overview of the Tascam Sonic View 16XP 16 channel digital mixer and multi track recorder. When it comes to mid to high end hardware external digital mixers, there's a lot to choose from on the market today. Established brands such as Allen and Heath, Behringer, Personas, Soundcraft, and Yamaha, to name a few all have external digital mixers available well above the $3,000 price point. Now, I can't afford to pay $3,000 or more for a digital mixer, but for those of you who can, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Now, here's the deal. Tascam has thrown its hat into the high-end hardware external digital mixer ring with the new Tascam Sonic View product line. Sonic View models include the Sonic View 24 XP 24 channel digital mixer and multi track recorder, which currently retails for $6,999. The Sonic View 16 XP 16 channel digital mixer and multi track recorder, which is the focus of this specific presentation, which currently retails for $5,999. And the SB16D. Now this is a 16 in 16 out Dante enabled analog converter with built in 32 bit ADC and class one HDIA mic preamps. It can be controlled with the Tascam IO control app or with the Tascam Sonic View model series. This unit retails for $2,499. Sonic View 24 XP and 16 XP are both multi-track digital recorders as well as digital mixing consoles. Many of the other high-end digital mixer brands mentioned do not include onboard standalone hardware for multi-track digital recording. Now this is important to keep in mind because it's one of the features that makes the Sonic View model series more expensive. With the release of the new Tascam Sonic View series, Tascam appears to be targeting individuals who want the features of a high-end digital mixer and onboard standalone multi-track digital recording without being required, and that's the keyword, required to connect to a PC and work using digital audio workstation or DAW software applications. You have a choice. In this presentation, we're going to do an overview of the Tascam Sonic View 16 XP. We'll check out the unit's features, technical specifications, top panel views, and its back panel. Let's start with the Tascam Sonic View 16 XP's features, and there are a lot of them. To start, the unit has two 7 inch display touch panels. And there are 44 input channels and four effects returns. The unit has 22 flexible output buses, a main left right bus, and a 31 band graphic EQ. It also has 96 KHC and a 54 bit float point mixing engine. This is going to sound good. It also has 32 bit 96 KHC analog to digital and digital to analog conversion. It includes Tascam's Class 1 HDIA microphone preamps, some really good preamps, and it has 32 in, 32 out, 32 bit, 96 KHz USB audio interface. So you have the choice of working with a digital audio workstation software package, but there's also a built in 32 tracks SDXC digital recorder, so you can record standalone also if you choose to. The unit has 64 in, 64 out built in Dante interface. And Dante over IP networks, if you're not familiar, what this does is integrate thousands of concert touring systems as well as installed systems in recording studios worldwide, radio stations, and more. Moving on, there are 16 mic line inputs um, and 16 XLR line inputs. The unit has four onboard multi effects processors. There is Tascam Sonic View control software for every OS um, out there so that you can remote control the unit and you can also use it for offline editing. There are two Tascam expansion slots on the back of the unit. The first is an SDXC multi-track recording card 
uh, that comes installed with the unit so you don't have to buy it. And with the other slot, the slot two, there are optional other cards that you can buy um, that are available. So moving on, the library on the unit includes snapshot, effect, module, parametric EQ, graphic EQ, gate and compressor. There are 18 assignable user keys, seven custom fader layers, and eight DCA groups. The unit also has a 16 by one, 100 millimeter motorized faders. They're gonna be really nice and nice long glide for you. Those are quality faders. There are also 16 LEDs with color LED display channel name, input level, and gain reduction meter. The unit has two channel internal recording playback with SD card or USB flash drive. There are quarter inch and eighth inch headphone outputs. The unit also has a gigabit ethernet port, a TRS foot switch jack is also included, and the unit's rack mountable with the optional rack mount kit. We'll move on to a high level and quick overview of the Tascam SonicView 16XP's technical specifications. Here we have a digital mixer with multi-track recorder functionality. It's a 16 channel digital mixer with 12 XLR input mic preamps. It also has phantom power on 16 channels. Below that we have our line inputs, our other inputs, and our main outputs. The inserts are on channels seven and eight, and we also have a talkback connector. For data IO, we have a Dante enabled ethernet ports, uh, and the unit has two headphone jacks as well as a USB type B input. The PC connectivity, you're gonna to connect to a PC via uh, either USB or ethernet with this unit. And on the back, there are two IO expansion card slots. Moving on. The unit also includes a world clock uh, connector, uh, actually two of them, one for in and the other is an out through. Uh, the unit has 17 motorized faders. And we talked about the analog to digital and digital to analog resolution in our features. The unit is a 31 band, uh, it has 31 band EQ and it has four effects processors. And the signal processing includes uh, parametric EQ, graphic uh, EQ, gate and compressor. It has two seven inch touchscreens and storage is handled by SD cards. Now you can remote control the unit with the Tascam Sonic View Control software. The power source is standard AC cable and below that is the height, depth, width and weight of the unit. As stated previously, the Tascam Sonic View 16 XP has two touchscreens. The system is designed to provide three different ways users can view their settings. With this, each touch screen can be configured independently so that users can monitor and control any combination of settings in whatever screens they choose. To invoke this functionality, users must select the channel strip view. Here, users can monitor and control the eight channels in that view and view them as virtual channel strips, just like an analog mixer configuration. In the module view, users can then monitor and control any two sets of parameters for one single channel, including the compressor, graphic EQ, and effect send. Last but not least is the individual view. Now through the individual view, users can see all functions for any channel or group of channels, all on different screens at the same time. Now, we'll review the Tascam Sonic View 16 XP's back panel. Starting from left to right on your screen, First, we have the LAMP XLR 4-pin female connector. To the right, we have the 16 XLR mic line inputs. On the next line, we start with our talkback 
XLR input. And to the right of that, we have eight quarter inch line inputs for channels nine through 16. To the right of those, we have two quarter inch inserts. And below this, we have 16 XLR line outputs. Below that, we have our Dante primary and secondary Ethercon Cat5e compatible connectors. To the right, we have our word through and out and the word in BNC unbalanced connectors. Next, we have a quarter inch foot switch connector. Beside that, we have a USB type B connector. Next is our Ethernet RJ45 connector. Beside that is a GPIO DSUB 25 pin female inch type connector. Then we have a stereo in, or should I say our stereo in to RCA left and right inputs. And then the stereo in one RCA left and right inputs. After that, we have the AC in for the power cord. And below on the bottom level from left to right, first we have the expansion slot two. To the right of that, we have the expansion slot one with the multi-track recording card installed. Last but not least, we have the on off power switch. Well, my friends, that's a wrap. If you like this presentation, please give it the thumbs up and click the subscribe button on your screen now to join our group. We have new presentations coming out every seven to 14 days and we would love to have you be a part of our team. Also leave a comment in the comment section below and let us know what you think about this content. And check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Spotify, and TikTok. While you're here, listen to some of the other music, check out some of the other videos, and especially the, the playlist because they are designed just for you. Thank you so much for stopping by. We really do appreciate it, and we look forward to seeing you soon.